Okay, in the first video here, we're going to go over logging into your dashboard and the admin panel within WordPress. WordPress is the software that is containing your content management system, basically. And WordPress is open source software, which means it's free to use and open to the public, as well as open to developers and programmers. So they can freely make the application that much better. So what we're going to do first is go to nmspealbuquerque.org forward slash wp hyphen admin, A-D-M-I-N, and it'll bring you to a login screen, like the one you see in front of you right now. So for user, you're going to enter your username, and then for password, enter the password. And then click login. And immediately you'll be taken to your dashboard. And on your dashboard, you're going to have a breakdown of how many posts, how many pages, categories, etc. And we'll go through posts and pages in the next video here. You also on the right hand side have had a quick press, so you can do a quick post if you don't want to actually go into the editing area for posts. Then you have recent comments, recent drafts. Uh, development blog and some other things and then also at the bottom you have your shop statistics which basically is your e-commerce section and then it also has your shop products view all and shop orders so right as soon as you log into your dashboard you can see if anybody has placed any orders you can also move these blocks around so you can move this one up to the top if that's where you wanted it put that up at the top and it'd be up at the top when you first log in. On the left hand side is all your main navigation and that's what we'll be dealing with mostly in the next videos and up in the right hand corner you have your logout, your profile and then you also have a drop down menu to do a new post, new page, etc. Not too concerned with this stuff over here. Uh, we'll basically be dealing with the left hand side. At the very top left you have a visit site button which you can click and it will take you to the website so you can look and work in the dashboard and in the admin panel and change content and then immediately view what it's going to look like in the actual site and vice versa you can go back and forth in your feature so basically this is the dashboard the admin panel left side is our main links that we're going to be dealing with and that's it